So we are going to do some grocery shopping. Um, Michelle loves grocery shopping. And we're all shy, so we might not film a lot of this inside the store. But um, I thought I thought this would be a good um, vlog to do because a lot of people will use this setup for vlogging. It's the Tamron 20mm 2.8 with the Sony a6400 which is kind of the ideal setup but um, it's a little bit close so I gotta hold it quite far out to ooh, to uh, be able to see everything but this is kind of what the test would be I think I'm gonna sell this lens though um, to get the 16mm 1.4 don't mind me um, yeah so we'll do this as a test run for um, vlogging situation I've got a uh, road micro on the top here if you want to know what the sound is tell me if you can hear the little clickiness that happens when you when you use this lens like especially when I don't move a lot you'll hear this like tick, 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 like it's trying to maintain focus let me know what you think about the quality and so on this is recording in 4k but um, yeah Michelle's car is kind of gangster and loud so you might not be able to hear me very well my car is gangster with the old lady okay you be nice about it if she won't drive so many beeps okay we'll see you just now uh keep watching Whee! Talk that talk in reality, you have not seen me in action You think the come up comes overnight, you ain't behind the scenes Trust me, these things don't just happen No shade to Gerald, but G's don't come easy When you tryna eat, I produce and rap I read that contract, you sent me to sign But excuse me, I can't help myself Well, I'm dodging potholes, what do you want me to do? By the way, this is how close you can focus with the macro lens yeah, I don't know if that comes in handy for your vlogs, but um Good to know it can. By the way, oh man, Michelle. What? Let us know in the comments what the lockdown's like in your countries. It's nice to know, hear from all of you. Ours is bad. Like we gotta stay home all the time unless you're going to buy food. But the we're going to level three now, so I should be able to at least do some photo shoots. Oh my God. Hopefully. Shoes where the f you want to park. Indicator would be nice. Just don't say anything. And Michelle gets don't. to go teach again soon, I think. Kids go back to school on the first of June. First of June, they go back to school, and then I think two weeks later she goes back because she's grade fours. Fives. Fives. But uh, yeah, so. She's, she's still trying to park. Stop yelling at people. How was shopping? Boring. As always. I need to get better at filming in the shop, but it's weird. Yeah. That little bit of food costs ridiculous amounts of money. But we would like to eat and put not it, starve. Put, so. put it over my nose. Ah. <laughs> I hate this mask story. Oh, this is the lens, if you want to see it. I'll do some tests now when I get home about the noise that I was talking about. And uh, see if you can hear it. Anyway, I'll see you guys just now. Now we head home with my Uber driver. You gotta discuss some serious things with the YouTubes. Discuss what? How was school? It's fine. How's the How's the South African ed education plan going? Well, the Department of Education's plan is, but the school I'm currently working at, their plan is is, is getting there. We learned all about it today, and we discussed how it's gonna work so it's gonna be fun am i allowed to put this on youtube hey you try to cut out a piece of my pie and i asked you politely it's when i drop my dead cat out the window yup by the way this is a really cool tripod if you would love it's a joby something watch our fucking go
Pam Pam. Look at you. Like a zoo. Um, so this tripod's very cool. It's a Joby Joby something. It's not a gorilla pod, it's like a like a it's got a pole and it extends out. It can go pretty high. And it and it works pretty well. Um mm -hmm. the only time it doesn't work well is if you've got a big lens on because then it wants to fall over. This is really bad lighting. What up people? We're gonna continue today's vlog with uh Day two, obviously that yesterday we went to the shops. Um, yeah, I wanted to show you a few more things about this lens, but um, yeah, I'm gonna go and do one thing today because I saw these here. These are from, these are flowers, by the way. Um, they're from the local uh, flower guy that's on the corner. They've held out so well. It reminded me of him, so I'm gonna go and get some more of these from Michelle and then uh, carry on from there. So, Are you filming me? Well, I started filming before you said you're coming home. Oh. You want to come with me? Here we go. I'm going to walk to Michael. Okay. Because I saw these flowers looking really good. So, damn, it's bright today. Michelle started work yesterday. Did you start work? Well, yeah, I got to work. <laughs> you go to work, but mm -hmm. you didn't start work. I've been working for like the last couple of weeks though, online. Yeah, I but you went, went back to school. I actually went into school. Michael's not there. Damn it! Sorry, my love. Okay, well, I was, gonna, I was gonna go to Michael, but he's not there, so... That was the shortest walk ever. We got out the house! Woo. I wanted you guys to hear this noise. Do you hear that? That the lens makes? It usually only happens when you're doing this kind of thing, so... The, the focus is barely moving, because it's on my face. Um, and then it's got this like clicky clicky noise and it, I'm not gonna normally I do uh, I do I, I stabilize the footage and that takes away this like jerky clicky thing but the noise you can't get away with it so unless you're recording audio so if I had audio here I could kind of get away with it because you won't hear it but I've got the the Rode Micro on now and you will probably hear it still even though it's shotgun miking to me um, if I use the internal audio it's much worse but this is obviously plugged in so I can't do that that one clicky thing when I use this thing, this uh, lens for interviews, it throws off the whole like audio. It's very annoying, and that visual click that happens, I don't know what that's about. So with my 35 1.8, this doesn't happen, and with the 28 25, this didn't happen either. This clicky noise and the shift in the image is very annoying, so I'm probably going to get rid of this too. So if there's any other tests you want me to do on this lens before I get rid of it, please let me know in the comments. Okay, so the only other way to get around the clickiness is to to once you have focus, turn it to manual focus. But then the whole point about face tracking being so good in the Sony camera, you're just ignoring it. You might as well use any other lens. I don't think I'm going to hold on to this lens much longer. But it was it was nice to have for a bit. And people seem to like the content with it. So let me know if you want me to do any other tests before I sell it. And then I'm probably going to buy a Sigma 16mm 1.4 for vlogging. And then I must get the 2470 Sigma art lens as well to do some tests on. So if there's anything specific you want me to do, please let me know down there. Anyway, let's carry on. So, I planned on doing the rest of this uh, video and try and finishing it off. But uh, right before I tried to do that, we had load shedding. Which in other countries, you don't know what that is because they don't just turn your power off for no reason. But uh, we don't know if it's load shedding or power failure, but we're all in the dark, so you can see. Pitch black. We got a candle. Michelle's feeling real grumpy because we couldn't cook dinner. And um, if you can hear that funny fan noise that's the UPS well thankfully Jasmine's dad left for us when they moved to Germany so uh, at least we have power for a few hours to keep working COVID off the kitchen is. remember giving away a camera there's a link up there so a really cool thing I was busy uh, procrastinating on YouTube and uh, I see all the content creators videos went live at the same time with the Sony ZV-1 vlogging camera the, like went nuts so let me know in the comments below uh, what you think about that camera because I've watched about four different ones from Potato Jet and uh, Maria Apoya and Jessica Cabezas videos and I I really like the idea of it but I'd like to try one so I've messaged Sony already in South Africa and I've asked the minute they get a sample I'll get one um, and they'll let me test it for a few days so if you have any questions about it something specific you want me to test other than what they've done already 
um, let me know and then I'll jump on I'll jump on that as soon as I get it anyway hope you guys are keeping well and safe and not in the dark and if you're in South Africa let us know about your dark lockdown situations anyway I want to say cheers you want to say bye Michelle no she's not a happy camper and deliveries are closed we can't even order food online what are we having toast we can't have toast We have popcorn and tinned food. I think that's all. I'm getting angry. So. Yeah, so we did really well as um, adults. We and were going to do well as adults. We were going to make fucking chicken and mashed potatoes. <laughs> so we Stupid were going to cook, but anyway. If you wanted a, a low light test on this A6400, this is a 6400 ISO right now. So, I don't know. Anyway, see you guys next time. Peace.